you can have a tour of my caravan. Okay, here we have the dressing area. Okay, where well, you've got your little sink there and lots of cupboard space, blind that fully works going up and down. So more, even more cupboard space under there. Um, I love this. I only found this the other day. It's a secret mirror or a secret cupboard. I can get into it. There you go. Behind the mirror is a little cupboard. Okay, going through. And here we have another huge cupboard. That's where all the electrics are under there. Well, your RCD and things like that. Plenty of hanging space. Okay, coming round. Ah, oh, this is my favourite bit as well. Um, you can make this area totally cut off. So at the back here, you've got a little dressing area. So you can come down. You open this catch here, and you open this catch here, and then <laughs> you shut yourself off. You can't really see this, it's a bit, it's a bit tight in here. Okay, me squished in there. Okay, but um, you've got your own little dressing area. Okay, shut off from from the from the world. Um, I'm got to decorate this bathroom. Okay, but I'm not too sure what colour to do it in yet. I'm going to do it in um, probably cream, and I'm going to probably use some sort of tile to tile around the back of here. But it's in pretty good nick. There's definitely no damp in here as well. Here we have the loo. This is how you flush the loo. Oh, I can show you. This is how you flush the loo. And see the pink fluid going down. You can get oh, oh, lots of wheeze and poos in there. And then just we open that up. That goes down into the cassette, which I've got to empty before the cold weather comes. Got your loo roll holder there. Your water tank for your water. And your waste master there too. As I say, I've got to do a bit of decorating in here, but basically it's dry. Okay. Coming round to the front, you see you've got your door back there again now. So you can get into the bathroom that way too. Okay. Um, lovely fridge, which is working perfectly on gas and on electric. Um, toaster and microwave that was left here by the previous occupants, but um, I suppose they could be used. A pretty good quality, DeLonghi. And there we have also a Philips microwave, which is actually nicer than the one we got inside, so I'm going to probably take that inside. Um, lots of things to do here, a bit of decorating to do here. I'm going to obviously take all, those, all the clutter off the shelves when we're going along now here we have a lovely gas cooker which works perfectly on gas and the gas hob too which I've already tried out because I've got my two kettles there shiny 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 I've got to empty all the water out um, yet to use the water heater because not too sure how it works which is stupid because I work in a caravan place um, here you just got under your sink you have got cutlery drawer with everything in it already I need a magnetic catch on that though under here you've got pots and pans and more storage space too um, coming up lots of storage here for your crockery thank you Marquis and also we've got a more melamine plate so it's all nice and light very deep cupboards all coming around the front there won't bother going into every single cupboard there 
but um, as you can see it's all very nice I might go to that one because I quite like that one it's got the glasses in it uh, uh, Ariel okay I bet you're wondering how the bed comes out nice and easy here okay have to move the heater which which works works lovely and here we have she says this is how you do the bed skew with hang on a sec very nice firm slats nice and easy to use and then of course you turn the covers up the other way and there you've got your bed so let's see how easy this goes in it's hard doing it with one hand I must admit oh, yeah come to a full stop which is why you need two hands to do it with um, I need to get some curtains in here, but that's next on my list to do. And there you go. There's the short view of my lovely camera.